Hi everyone, thanks for coming to this special reading. I had the feeling that I had to do this one today and uh, to call it uh, Your Angel Has the Answer. I do have uh, uh, angel cards here today and um, I just wanted to concentrate and which crystal calls your attention, uh, your attention, the one that uh, speaks to you, you know, like I always say, go with the first choice, your gut feeling. And this is a selenite crystal. Okay, in case you want to think of pile number one, group number one, selenite. Group number two, the amethyst pyramid. This one featured in my previous video, lovely one. And this is the labradorite crystal. Okay. So you ask your question first. That's my feeling for today. You first you ask your question and then choose, make a choice. And the timestamp will be in the description and all the details and even about the cards, about the crystals, everything will be in the description below. If you like this video, let me know and uh, subscribe for more. Like if you, if you like this kind of video, but like I say, please first, ask your question and then choose and we come back okay thank you if you are group number one with this beautiful selenite crystal okay and you know your question already so this is your first card for today okay can you see the heart chakra so the card is saying here for you the answer that you seek is in your heart right now be open to giving and receiving love so this card is quite clear that you already know in your heart what you want you just maybe uh, stopping yourself to make a decision there and um, you actually need to pay attention to your feelings you know and uh, make sure you're true to yourself and you will know exactly what to do in this situation. You know what's going on. But my feeling is be true to yourself. That's mainly what is coming uh, to me right now. And be open, you know, to giving and receiving love. So you may be stuck there. You may be stopping yourself. But the answer is already there in your heart. In your heart, when you pay attention, that gut feeling, you will know exactly what to do. So it's right there. It's waiting for you. It's mainly uh, you need to act. Okay? So don't stop yourself. Don't overthink. Meditate. We do need to stop and think. But the answer is already there for you. I do have a second angel card. Which is beautiful. Divine divine guidance this card is about timing about knowing that this right now is the right time to make that decision you actually know what we're talking about here the angels guide uh, are guiding us here the divine guidance so the divine the higher powers the universe however you want to call this is the timing so you have already waited enough that's my feeling here and this is the time to make that decision. This is actually pointing to, I don't know exactly what your question is, but it's, it's to, yes, you have to go ahead and act on this. Okay, so this is the divine guidance. So listen, pay attention to your feelings. How can you actually uh, make this decision in the best way with uh, an open heart? Okay. And uh, they are connecting here with each other. Make sure you're open to receive, to give and to receive love. Okay, so this is the timing. This is the divine guidance. Pay attention. They're telling you you're in the right path. And I do have here, this is a beautiful card that you actually have two sides. Okay, we have the other side here as well with the meditation, the prayer, or the affirmation, however I want to call on the other side so this is the with the stones this is the archangel and stones 
uh, deck, this, the card is asking here, are you trying to process a lot of information? Take the time to sort out all that is happening. Write it in your journal. Make it your intention to remember your dreams. Record your thoughts and memories upon waking. Find peace as you process each nugget of information, awareness and spiritual growth. So in case you, you, you're thinking, how do you actually make a decision? It's when you actually stop. This card is quite clear. It's giving you steps, what you can do. Write it down, pay attention to your dreams. The answers are there for you. So what else can you do that you know, listen to this sign? This is the divine guidance could be on your dreams, on things that are happening, coincidences, things that are going on throughout your day. Write them down, keep a small, maybe a notebook with you close to you so you can write it on, right next to your bed when you wake up, you have a dream. It's very easy to forget if, when you don't write it down straight away. So take your time and go through it and see how the guidance, the divine guidance is pointing so to make it easy for you to make that decision. Okay, we have the other side here, like I said, prayer or affirmation. This is from the Archangel Gabriel. Meditation is a normal part of my day. My crown, third eye and throat chakras are balanced and aligned. My intuition is intact. I consciously request and accept the help of angels. My life flows easily with grace. What a lovely affirmation prayer for you today. For you to, to really trust that you are making the right decision. So if the question was yes or no, this is a yes. Okay, guys. So this is like, if it's like, should I do it? Should I not? It's like divine timing, divine guidance. This is like a positive. This is a positive thing that you can continue, you should do it, you should go ahead and you know what to do. You actually know what to do. It doesn't mean that it's all happy, happy. You know, you know it could be some hard choices here to be to be made. But we are talking about if the it is is the right choice. You know in your heart of hearts the answer are ready. And pay attention, write it down, your feelings, how you're doing, meditate and act. It's it's, it's there for you, it's waiting for you, and uh, this would be what I, I feel the, ang the angels have here for you, okay? So, you know your question there, and uh, this is your answer. I hope it resonates with uh, many people. I know sometimes it's not the case, but maybe you should choose another crystal if this is not resonating with you. Feel like, meditate on which one you actually, it's your one. But um, the guidance here, it's positive. It's like, you're on the right path. Go ahead. Okay? So group number one, the beautiful selenite crystal. This is your answer. If you have to take a screenshot of this, meditate, repeat this here. It's open, so pay attention. Make everything open and flow for you. Okay? Thank you very much. Group number two, if you chose this beautiful amethyst pyramid, okay, those are your cards for you. Remember your question, make sure you know your question, and this is your first card, okay? So this is your first card here, singing and dancing. Exp express yourself and awaken your psychic senses through the magical power of music and movement. This card here is it's coming to me as a, a way for you to express yourself. It's really about make sure you are not holding back. So you know your question there, but this one is really about saying, yes, you should express yourself. You should, you should go after this dream that you want. This is really like saying, bring some happiness to your life, bring some singing and dancing. Bring, Bring music to your life, pay attention to what is going on there because you will be able to express yourself more positively and uh, more true to yourself, really. I have a feeling that this is about being true to yourself. 
what you actually want to do what the, do you really like to do what you enjoy what are you doing right now that you maybe you should change i feel like this is about a change you need to make a hard choice there and uh, choose your happiness so this is about putting yourself first that's my feeling with this card so the angels are telling you sing dance express yourself those those purple blue colors are really similar to the amethyst and to the throat chakra so it's about speaking being able to be vocal what what you want so this is about put yourself first think about you with, with with this question you you know what you ask but this is like put yourself first that's your answer the, the first impression i have here with this one the second question lovely one power okay so it's very very clear power it's about taking your power back so like i say here it's like you're not expressing yourself you're not putting yourself first take your power back it's there it's out there for you and you need to put yourself first it's really taking your power back and maybe you have given this power away to someone else or a different situation and this is not right make sure you that you are choosing yourself first first take your power back the answer here for you is put yourself first take your power back you have you have this power it's inside you maybe it's hidden maybe it has been uh, hidden for a while because of the, the hard situations you're going through at the moment but i tell you it's there for you 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 have you have this power inside you you have this this flame that can come back this this fire is not dead so put yourself first you deserve you deserve the best and uh, that's my feeling here it's like your answer is about making sure that you put yourself first take your power back from whoever whatever situation it has maybe overpowered you or you feel like that we may feel like that for for a while depending on the situation but that's not true we we can take it back so think of yourself your answer is guiding me here to say it's about you it's about, about time you think about you and put yourself first okay so i do have the third card here which is a two-sided card okay from the archangels and the the gemstones uh, deck and i read for you the first side here is are you ready to attract the best of everything do you believe the best is yet to come make a clear decision to manifest the good in this moment don't wait until tomorrow you are being called to experience spiritually in everyday living see all the love that is in everything very very powerful beautiful card here for you again telling you are you ready for this change now can you see the the best the great things that can come to you can you see that coming to you you can manifest the best you know the great there are great great things waiting for you you do need to put yourself first and you can manifest what you want you actually have dreams that may have been just sleeping at the moment like wake wake up wake up for your dreams for what you actually really really want you deserve the best you deserve to manifest what you want in your life so don't let anybody any any situation overpower you put music when you want dance when you want be free don't worry about what the other people will say when you make this decision it's about you it's about time you put yourself first that's my feeling here with your card and we do have the other side with the prayer meditation or an affirmation however you want to call in this case from the archangel uriel and they say i am blessed with irresistible love and spiritual influence all that i need is always within my reach extraordinary love and amazing wealth are always available to me 
I have an abundance of spiritual helpers ready to assist me in all areas of my life. Wow, what a powerful, powerful affirmation, meditation, prayer here for you. This is about receiving. You have, you are blessed. You have the right, you have the influence. All the good things can come to you. Wealth, amazing, amazing life. Take the power back. You deserve it. This is about you. So you know what question you had there in your mind. And your answer is, put yourself first. Take your power back. And the great, great things, your amazing dreams can come true. You can attract all the right people, the right choices, the right, right, great things that you can achieve in your life. Make sure you put yourself first to begin with and the other things will flow. Okay, so if you want to take a screenshot of this, especially the affirmation, those are beautiful cards. All the links will be in the description about them anyway. And uh, if you want to take at, le at least a screenshot of this one to repeat through all the days, meditate on, remember, you deserve the best. Put yourself first. Okay, so group number two with the beautiful amethyst, that is what is my feeling for you today that great, great things are waiting for you. You just need to start acting. You know, it's about time. It's about time. That's my, my, uh, the angel's answer for you today. Okay, group number two, thanks very much for your time. And then move on to the next one. Thank you. Group number three, if you chose this beautiful Labradorite, lovely, lovely crystal, you know your question. So here is the answer from the angels to you. Okay, your first card is this one here. Have you asked your angels for help with this? Your angels want to help you with this situation. However, they require your permission before they can intervene in your free will choices. Okay, this is very clear that the angels, the higher powers, they are there available, available and trying and hoping to help you. But it's like you're stopping this help to come to you. So this is really about looking around. Where is, where are you stopping this help to come to you? Not just because the angels, the higher powers, they can move people. They can move and change situations. The door could be there open for you. You just don't want to cross. So my feeling here is that you know what to do. Or even you, you can see the door open. You're just not crossing. So it's about accepting the help that you need for this situation, look around. Who are these people that are there waiting for you, trying to assist you and maybe you said no? They could have been sent by the higher powers and you just didn't realize. But for me, you know your question there, but my feeling is that you are so close to make the decision. You know what to do, you're just stuck. At the moment you're just not doing it so i have a feeling you need to take action here you need to take that next step and accept the help that look around you may may not have seen or maybe you have seen but you are stopping it so accept the help and uh, above all the helps all the angels the higher powers are there helping you but depends of you they will not inter in interfere with your free will choices so if at the end of the day you may want to change you may want to this this question to be answered and, and yes to be a yes or this situation to change but if you don't you don't move you don't choose anything you don't think that not doing anything will actually change the situation because 
not doing anything is also a choice. It's already a choice made that you want the situation the way it is. So if you want something changed, you have to take that next step and the help that is coming there for you. Okay, I will take the next card here. It's about, right, this card is very clear. It's about study. And in this case, a study could mean, depending who you are, like real, real study, like go ahead, like take that course, go ahead, study is the right choice for you. And I have a feeling as well, study the situation, right? Have a look of what is accessible there for you. So you know what the question you had, and I say to you, you need to take the next step, accept the help, study the situation, look around and to make to make the choice. Look who's there to help you. Look around you. Study the situation. This could be a straightforward start studying, like really like, like I said, a course, a school. Go ahead, the answer is study. But I also have a feeling, study this situation. Who is there for you? Okay. And we also have uh, these lovely cards from the Archangel and Gemstones cards, which have two sides. Okay. So the first side here you have, are you feeling confused? Are you in search of wisdom and deeper spiritual insight? Engage in illuminating activities such as meditation, contemplation, and reflection to better understand the true nature of reality. Pray. Allow for spiritual truth to be revealed. I think this is very clear as well, guys. This is really saying to you that it looks like you're confused at the moment, but you want that wisdom, you want that that spiritual growth that insight maybe that even like studying this what's going around you or really learning new skills and but you're confused you're not uh, you, you don't know exactly what to do this is about paying attention and putting yourself into higher activities meditation contemplation talking to people around the higher powers the, the the things that really interest you i feel like they're quite high and uh, spiritual related so if that's what your interest don't hold back go ahead who's around you that can help you with this and uh, how can you learn more about the situation what can you see around you your answer here is Take that next step, accept that help, study the situation and you will engage and go more into the higher spiritual activities. So this is how I feel here for you. It's like the answer is take the next step with that help. That help is right there available for you. Okay, there is more to learn, there is more to grow from where you are at the moment and you're gonna go into a much higher spiritual path which you'll be very very happy about okay we do have it say to you pray ask allow for spiritual truth to be revealed to you you actually have lovely growth coming to your lovely path of growth of spiritual understanding this is I have a feeling it's really high powers here talking to you. This is the right way. Okay, and we do have the other side. Like I said, it's a prayer, a meditation or a, an affirmation, however you want to take it. And it's from the Archangel Michael. In this case, the affirmation is for you to repeat, all right? It is, I am blessed with deep understanding. I have a clear view of the truth. I am grateful that I have mental clarity. My spiritual life is full. 
I love to share my blessings with others. I have great poise and grace. Lovely, lovely affirmation. Prayer here for you. This is really about taking the next step and getting to this blessing. Great, higher, higher power, higher path, spiritual path here for you. And being able to act this way. I am blessed with deep understanding. So no more confusion. You, you learn there's a growth path here. And there is a real, real great a spiritual path that is here for you. That you will be so happy about it. So don't hold back. Take that next step. No more confusion. This is it. Okay? So accept the help. That's your answer. Study the situation. Go ahead to learn. Study more. You will need to learn a bit more and you get to a much, much higher understanding, spiritual growth here for you, which you'll be very happy about. Even though this is something a little bit in the future, something that you need to go through the path, your affirmation is in the present, right? Because the higher powers, they, they don't have time. We are stuck to this time that we have past, present, future. They don't have that. So speak as if everything has already happened to you. Okay? So you have a beautiful, beautiful way to go here. Just take that next step. It's okay? So group number three, this is your answer. All right? I feel like you have a beautiful way to go. You just need to act and take that next step, that leap of faith and uh, accept the help, look around who's there for you. You don't need to do it all on your own, but you have a way to go that will be a great, great ending, okay? So if you made it to the end, uh, those are your answers, okay? The angel has your answer, those are your answers for today. And I'll thank you very much if you made it to the end. And like I said, Check below the links with all these beautiful cards and crystals. I'll try to find everything and leave it there for you, okay? So thanks for your time. Again, if you like this kind of video, let me know. Leave a like and a subscribe. And more will come, alright? Have a blessed day, okay? Bye-bye.